I wanted to talk to you about the Irish connection that your family has. Obviously, very, very strong. Both of your grandparents are from Ireland. Kind of tell me your knowledge of your history and ancestry to Ireland. Yes, sir. Like you said, um, both my grandparents, great grandparents, uh, immigrants from Ireland, moved into New York area. All of them immigrated from the Dublin area. Mm -hmm. So, uh, definitely a lot of heritage there. Came here. Uh, I have a, my father's uh, father, so my uh, grandfather fought, went back to Europe. So um, yeah, just like a lot of uh, Irish culture in our family, it's definitely like stemmed from them, brought down to me. So this game definitely means a, a lot to me, and I, I know it means a lot to some of my other teammates who have the same type of heritage going. So it was your great-grandfathers that were a Murphy and an O'Connor? That yeah, both. Uh, no, it's my uh, grandfather, so my mother's maiden name is uh, Murphy. Okay. All my sister's middle names are Murphy. Right. Uh, my father's uh, my father's name was O'Connor. Okay. So, um, are your grandfathers both living? Uh, no. Uh, my uh, dad's father has passed, but my mother's uh, is still um, Grand alive. Grandpa Murphy. Yeah, Grandpa Murphy. He's going to be watching. So. What, do you talk to them much about the Ireland? I mean, I'm, I'm sure they have great pride in their heritage. Yeah, they have a lots, lots of pride. Um, we talk to them about it. They're a little older and can't make it, but their kids, they're, she's one of nine and my dad's one of eight. So a lot of uncles, aunts coming. Um, some of them are actually Notre Dame alums. So mm -hmm. uh, I think they'll still be rooting for Navy though. So uh, have your parents or other members of your family been to Ireland before? Yeah, yeah, a bunch. Um, I was actually supposed to go to Ireland during COVID, but it, it shut that down. So uh, both my parents have been multiple times, all their, all my aunts and uncles. I actually don't think any of my sisters have, so it's a first for them. Do you know if you still have, I'm sure you do, uh, relatives that are still living in Ireland? I'm sure there's gotta be some- There's gotta be some, relatives. yeah. There's definitely gotta be someone there. Um, I don't know how close that connection is. I gotta talk to my dad before I answer that one, but there's gotta be someone out there. What, um, so kind of talk about, you know, this is such a unique opportunity and with your connection to the Ireland, I mean, it, and I'm sure when you get over there, Irish people are gonna be like O'Connor, right? Yeah. yeah. Come on, it's no brainer. Yeah, it's definitely uh, unique. I think I feel a little weight on my shoulders talking about the culture. We had a, a meeting just talking about some important points about their culture and uh, I can definitely see some eyes turn to me when that stuff comes up just because just of the name alone. And my middle name's Patrick as well, so. Uh, yeah, I definitely feel a little bit of weight on my shoulders about understanding their culture, which I do, obviously, but... So now I know you've been on the depth chart. I mean, are you, are you playing special teams? I mean, what do you envision your role being uh, in this game? Yeah, I think I'll definitely be out there on special teams. What um, units are you on? KOR, kickoff. Uh, I'm uh, in the depth on kickoff, or I'm KOR, so kickoff return, and then in the depth and kickoff. And then I'm in the depth and punt, so we'll see. And uh, I've been rotating two on offense, which is new for me, but uh, I envision myself helping out as, as much as I can during the game, so. So because of your Irish heritage, did you grow up rooting for Notre Dame? Uh, I, I didn't. I mean, I, there's always that, like, feeling maybe uh, I like, like Notre Dame like, more than the other teams, but uh, I think towards in high school, I always wanted to come to Navy, so I, I rooted for Navy. Okay. Um, yeah. What, um, and so, uh, have, you, have you played against Notre Dame in the past? Where you, did you get into last year's game by chance? No, I was hurt last year, so I didn't get into last year's game. So this one, especially being my uh, senior year, it's really come full circle for me, especially being in Ireland. So I'm super excited. It's my first outing, first Notre Dame, so. You have connections to Ireland. Your great-grandfather emigrated from Ireland. Kind of tell me your knowledge of your family's heritage and as it relates to Ireland. I don't know a whole lot, but I know they're, he's from Castle Island, County Kerry in Ireland. I know they had a farm there, and I know he immigrated over in 1929, I believe, when he was 19. Mm -hmm. And so I know a lot of my family, about 25 family members are going out there. That's I don't so know cool. if all are supported in Navy, but because a lot of them went to Notre Dame. So right, we'll, we'll right. Say, well, yeah. it sounds like the same as was uh, O'Connor. A lot of his family went to Notre Dame. Yes, sir. Did you grow up rooting for Notre Dame? Yes, I did. Yeah. You did? And then I found out about Navy, got in the Navy, and I was that switched right away. Uh -huh. Well, and but it was that a factor in you coming here, knowing that you'd have a chance to play against Notre Dame, and that's kind of definitely, cool, right? mm -hmm. definitely the coming here, knowing I had a chance to play Notre Dame, played a big part in coming here, and then uh, one of the quarterback in high school, Drew Pine, I played against him in high school. I know he went to Notre Dame, so I knew it'd be cool to play against them. So did um, 
Did you get into last year's Notre Dame game by chance? Unfortunately, no. I was a scout team last scout year. Scout team last year. Are you looking forward? Do you think you feel good that you'll be able to get into this one? Yes, yes, I do. I'm uh, on the depth on punt and kickoff return on two on both of those, and currently not one at tight end. So, right. hopefully. So how exciting is it going to be? I'm really excited. I'm pumped to go. Yeah. So going over there, I mean, I know it's a business trip and you're not going to be doing sightseeing, but I mean, will you try to soak it up being that you, this is your heritage? I mean, this is, I presume you have not been to Ireland? Before? I have not, no. Yeah, I'm really excited to go and try to soak up as much as possible. I don't know how much sightseeing we're going to do, but I know my family's going to, I know my great-grandfather had a farm out there. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, that burned down, but they're going to see some parts of it that remain, so I know they're all going to see some tourism. Hopefully, I can tag along for some things. I know it's a business trip. So uh, when you say 20 family members, I presume your parents, I mean, who who were some of the family members? Parents, you know? they're all on my dad's side. Uh, so uh, my parents, great parents, uncles, aunts, all from they all. Because I know my great grandfather had 12 siblings, I believe. So okay. there's a lot. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Did they, most of them stay in Ireland, or was did a lot of them emigrate to Maryland? A lot of them, to, uh, the United States. A lot of them came over. Yeah, they're all in like the Northeast area, like Long Island, New Jersey, Connecticut. So we're all over there right now. Okay. What um in terms of you know, just the meaning of playing in Ireland. I mean, it's so rare to play football in Ireland. It's mm -hmm. the Aer Lingus Classic. They've created a something special. I mean, I don't know if you knew that this game would be a possibility when you were coming here, but what do you think of it? Uh, I didn't know it was a possibility I was coming here. I remember getting the email and voting it, like saying we're going to play in Ireland, voting it right to my parents right away, saying I'm excited to go and we're going to work to get there. And then um, playing there means a lot. Playing around all my family, it's going to be the first game ever I played in, so it's a combination of both worlds, first game and being able to play something special, so special like Ireland. So were, do you wear the Collins connection too? Uh, me and Colin are good friends, so yeah, I knew he had a connection to Ireland as well, and I think they're probably going to meet up out there too. Right, so now are you, is your, are you uh, Irish from both sides of your parents? No, my dad is 100% Irish and my mother is Brazilian. So, okay, Yeah. that's interesting. Uh -huh. All right, mm -hmm. what, uh, and so, you know, is it going to be hard to be awestruck when you walk into a Viva Stadium, this big, you know, basically professional soccer mm -hmm. stadium? You know, Notre Dame's there. They're yep. all so big. I mean, how are you going to try to process this? You got to realize it's still a game. At the end of the day, it's still a football game. It means a lot, but at the end of the day, you know it's a game. And you're going to compete, you're compete no matter what, and not, not scared of anything. So you're going to go in there thinking it's nervous. It gets butterflies, obviously. Notre Dame's a big team, and there's going to be a lot of people there rooting for Notre Dame as well. But you got to realize you're there to win. So. Mm -hmm.